Brother Abdullah is asking about the ruling on donating organs. And we've gone through this so many times. So it's one of two. Either you're donating it before you die, while you're alive, or after your death. As for before you die, if these organs are replaceable or do not hinder your life and your activities and uh, uh, going on doing your business, such as if you have an extra kidney and you would like to donate it to a father, a mother, a spouse, a son, etc., and it would not harm your life afterwards, you can live a normal life without it, then this is permissible. If it's something that is hazardous to your life, like donating one of your eyes, this is totally prohibited. Uh, donating part of your liver, as they say that the liver grows later on, this is totally uh, per permissible. Donating your blood uh, that is uh, uh, capable of regenerating again, this is totally legit. Now, if you go to donating your organs after death, before the break, we spoke about respecting the privacy of the deceased. And the Prophet said, والسلام, the breaking of the bone of a deceased is like breaking the bone of a living person. So it is totally prohibited to donate any of your organs after death. First of all, this is not your body to donate or to write a will to cremate me, for example. Can I, can I do this? I'd like to ask my heirs to cremate me and uh, uh, throw my ashes over the ocean. No. Likewise, I cannot donate my body parts like people do, you know, the cornea, the, the eyes and the kidneys, the liver, the heart, the joints, etc. This is not a spare, a spare part shop. So this is not permissible. One would argue and say, Akhi, but if we don't do this, other people would, would die. So eventually they're going to die. If not today, maybe a couple of years later on, but they're going to die. This does not justify violating the Muslim's corpse by uh, uh, donating parts of it.